Hey, welcome to Sunrise Angler. Excuse me, welcome to van, vanlifefishing.com. I'll cut that out. Uh, just want to take a minute to show you how I'm putting this ceiling in here. Now, to start with, I put in a 5 millimeter uh, plywood panel screwed directly to the metal cross members. Now, a lot of people put in wooden pieces and screw to those, but I did not want to lower the ceiling enough to do that. So I put in the, the five millimeter, same as on the walls, screwed directly to the frame, to the, to the actual cross members of the metal. Then I'm taking quarter inch cedar paneling and I'm putting uh, construction cement on the back of it and then putting it in place with three quarter inch brads uh, with a nail gun. Now this has already got the glue on it. It's already up there. So we're gonna go ahead real quick and nail it in place. And then we'll get the next one ready. All the brads really do is just hold it in place. A lot of people just put it up there and Keep braces on it until the glue dries. Well, I guess I'm not patient enough. The brads do a real nice job of keeping it up there while the glue dries. And once that contract is con that uh, construction cement dries, it, it's dry. It uh, it will not come down. It stays up there forever. Okay. So let's take the next piece here. Let's one out. Let's pick the pretty side. I mean the smooth side. Okay, and this is tiny groove, so it's got to go that way. So the next step is to put some cement on the back of it. I don't know if you can see that with the angle of that, but I'll hold it up here so you can. Okay, so we're putting liquid nails is what we're actually using. Right around the back of here. Okay. Usually I lay this on the floor and I get a little bit neater struck, but it doesn't matter. As long as it's on there, that's what counts. Well, I'm really looking forward to getting this van built out. I, uh, the sink for the bathroom came in today. Real happy for that. More pieces every day are coming in. Um, we're going to use a, a unique framing system, which we will video later on and show you. I think you'll find it real interesting. You know, this can be fun, getting this to match up. The little tiny, it's on a quarter inch, so so your tongue and grooves are really, really small. Okay. To get it to match up can be a pain. But if it goes, okay, and this seems to be going fairly well so far. The end piece down here to go. It all started. Take, take a, a third hand, hold it in place for a minute. Take a little persuader. Go along here and see if we can't get it to set into place fairly well. Yeah, it's moving on over there so far. But now we get down to there. You hear it's not lined up. So then we get to go back to playing with it some more. Sometimes this can be really tedious to get this whole thing in. To line up and go. And sometimes it goes just like that. Which is really nice. And it does. So you want to get them all the way over there. You want to get all the boards tight together. You want these spaces. Don't get them all tight the same. 
Well, then your measurements come out off later. So there we go. Let's take a double check. Let's see how that looks. Oh yeah, it looks good. Now this looks like it's going quick. It, right at the moment it is. But I'm telling you, you have to stop and cut all these holes. You have to remeasure everything. And of course, it's a van, so nothing is the same any two places. Even from side to side, it's different. So. But I do like these tools. They certainly... Certainly a, a whole lot better than spending time waiting on with supports like this to keep it up there. So there you go. That's how it's going. Now, I'll take a quick tour behind the camera here real quick and see if we can't give you a shot of how the rest of it's coming. Camera out of here. Okay. There we go. So, so this is the front. If you move toward the back, you can see there's the hole for the max air, a hole for the, for the, I have a vent in my bathroom back there. That's what's in that back corner. It has a power vent as well. And up here, the big hole is for the air conditioner. Uh, so it's, and you see, I haven't got the other side yet. So there we go. That's how I'm putting the paneling up on the ceiling and on what exposed walls, what few exposed walls there will be. So there you go. Keep cruising. Keep casting. Go to vanlifefisherman, vanlinefishing.com and sign up for our blog. God bless now.